Hello, welcome to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. We've got a really weird video to for you today, I guess. Uh, Star Wars rumor: Lucasfilm is going to be moving ahead without Ray Park as Darth Maul, following a very strange Instagram post. Now it's not there anymore, um, but it was questionable in nature. And knowing Disney's aversion to questionable things uh, in nature, they're probably going to be binning Ray Park, who's obviously the you know the very famous. Darth Maul actor. So let's get into this. Um, if you're new here, do hit subscribe, all that good stuff, and you know, make sure you turn bell notifications on and hit like, all that crap. Um, but let's check it out, right? So will Ray Park continue to play Darth Maul? I mean, that's the question, isn't it, right? They're, especially because we've had rumoured now a long time when Obi-Wan Kenobi uh, series, that's confirmed, but we've also had rumoured multiple Darth Maul series, right? So you'd think, well, who are they going to get to play him then? Who? The actor? Probably not after what happened. Um, really, really, just so super weird. Basically, fans have been eager to see more Darth Maul in live action for quite some time. At the tail end of the solo a Star Wars story film, they got just that. So, obviously the movie itself did, well, basically bombed. Um, I, I think it lost money. I think it lost a lot of money because uh, of reshoots and things like that. It, it really did not do very well. Um, but obviously it did have in interesting implications for the rest of the world in terms of how they had set up Darth Maul in Solo, A Star Wars Story. I didn't hate Solo. I didn't hate it at all. It's not particularly, you know, an absolutely epic movie. It's super dumb decisions in certain bits and pieces. Darth Maul at the end was an interesting one. And it was interesting that they threw him in there literally at last minute as well. But, again, the implications that it set up is interesting. Especially for Obi-Wan Kenobi. Um, that series, because obviously he's going to be intertwined with that. Obviously we've, we've seen his end, his demise in Clone Wars. Um, but it's still interesting, there's still a story to tell there in terms of you know what he did in between. And I don't often like that, but I'd probably watch Darth Maul, I think. Now obviously it says it seemed like only a matter of time until we saw Darth Maul come back. After many years it seemed possible that actor and martial artist Ray Park could return to the beloved, uh, the beloved Star Wars role. Um, mm, several days back, we reported on an interesting rumour about that. So the rumour came from the Direct and stated that Darth Maul would be appearing in several live action series on Disney+. Plus. Now, rumour, rumour, uh, you know, as it might be, I believe that um, because again, we've got Kenobi. You know why wouldn't why wouldn't he be there? You know we've got the Mandalorian. Why wouldn't he? Why wouldn't he be there? I mean the Mandalorian likes to drop in people from time to time. It makes sense that these high profile, uh, per, you know, personas in the Star Wars franchise would drop in. It makes a lot of sense. Um, so as much as it's a rumor, I can definitely believe it. Obviously, it says this included a series that would reportedly feature Darth Maul as a main character. I think that would do very well, actually. Um, it, again, it's a funny one, isn't it, Darth Maul? Because even though we know where he ends up, I still think that there's a story to tell there, and I think people would genuinely want to watch it. Um, and I'm normally I'm massively against that, but unusually, I quite like the idea. Um, admittedly, we cannot confirm those specifics of those details, but we can confirm from our sources that Disney did plan on bringing Darth Maul uh, back to some extent. It makes sense. Again, Kenobi, for instance. Of course he'd be in Kenobi. Uh -huh. And then we get to this. What has he done? What has he done? And then there was a strange post on Park's social media that surfaced that same day. Um, basically, they don't list it, right? But basically, what happened was, <laughs> earlier this week, the actor allegedly shared a video on Instagram of a woman giving him oral. <laughs> Why? Why did you do that, mate? What are you doing? Oh, good lord! <laughs> okay, like I'm not, I'm not particularly great with Instagram or anything like that, but I'm definitely not going to be posting stuff like that. Like I think you'd know, like in terms of the edit, choose a choose a thumbnail, share. Like there's several stages at play there where. You know, if you're going to make a mistake, you'd, you'd catch it, wouldn't you? But anyway... <laughs> like, why? How? How and why? How and why? 
Obviously, it says that the story behind why and how that happened uh, is unclear. There are, however, plenty of theories and accusations doing the rounds. Basically, it turned, they, they think that he's done as a result of that, right? They think he's done. <laughs> I can't believe that. So, obviously, knowing Disney's history, it seemed only a matter of time until some action was taken. So, it seems Disney's made some action. Oh, <laughs> Ray Park's getting more action than he thought he was going to get. Oh, dear. My dad jokes are getting worse. Now, obviously, it says this isn't exactly a big surprise. While the circumstances surrounding the post from Park were unclear. Few scenarios looked good for the martial artist. Disney has never been a studio to court controversy, although they're very happy to leave the lead in Mulan to run a mouth against Hong Kong, but you know, whatever, I guess. Um, doesn't matter when it's to do with China, am I right? Um, so obviously the easiest move for them would be just to move on from Ray Park. Makes sense, they did it. Um, who else did they did it? Who else did they do it with? They did it with uh, James Gunn, although he's now back in the fold. But nothing quite as explicit as this, by the sounds of it. Um, again, which is just pretty unusual. Now, after all, Darth Maul is a character with paint over his face, so finding someone else to work with is a bit easier in most situations, which makes sense. Like, obviously, multiple people can do the character, right? They can do it. Um, in fact, there's someone else doing the voice. You know, there's people doing the voice all over the place, so. Can someone else do Darth Maul? Yeah. Like, inevitably, of course they can. Um, and obviously this this article goes on to say, you know, but who would replace Park? And they obviously point out Sam Witwer, uh, which makes sense and is an obvious choice, as they note, because obviously he voices Maul in the animated series. Plus, if you shaved his head and put on the necessary makeup, you would likely get something not too far from what we pictured Darth Maul as. That being said, there are no details on how Disney plans to move forward, and all we know right now is that they won't be moving forward with Ray Park. Ha <sighs> what are you doing, mate? What are you doing, son? What are you doing? Um look, look in in terms of in terms of Darth Maul and Ray Park and things like that. Like Ray would it be cool to see Ray Park back? Yeah of of course it would, like inevitably. Um it's difficult to come back from this though, isn't it? You know, how do you come back from this? And I'm not for cancel culture, but I'm just assessing, you know, you, you take a look at Disney as a brand, right? They are predominantly for children. Star Wars is something that they market for children now, more so than adults. So how are you gonna come back from that? How's Ray Park gonna come back from this? And again, I'm not, I am not, promoting cancel culture. I don't want him to be cancelled, but it's one of those things that you look at and you go, well, it's almost, you know, a foregone conclusion at this point in time. How would he come back from this? How would Disney rehire him, or at least just have him hired, uh, and save face on the circumstances? They can't not address it if they were to keep him, right? I'm sure you would agree. And then if they get rid of him, then they don't have to address it anyway, because they just hire someone else. So it's a really difficult scenario to go into, but I, I, I think he's done. I think he's done. I think it's a shame, mind you. I do think it's a shame. But I also think how stupid you have to be to share a video of someone giving you head. Uh, not the smartest. Not the smartest dude. Um, maybe he was intoxicated. Who knows? It sounds like he probably was. Um, but there you go. Darth Maul series. Probably not with Ray Park. After a dodgy, 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 dodgy. Instagram post. What do you guys think? Please do let me know all of your thoughts down below in the comment section. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, like I said, please do hit subscribe. You can stay up to date on the world of pop culture and movie news and some movie reviews by hitting the bell notification icon. I did a review earlier. It wasn't really a review. It was more of a discussion video on taxidermia, which is just like the weirdest, is the weirdest film I have ever seen. A Hungarian flick. I'll leave it linked above. Um, the video, anyway. Uh, check it out. It's super bizarre. Super, super weird. Expect a few more uh, review videos coming soon. Obviously, that one wasn't really a review, but expect a few more coming soon. And if you enjoy my content, guys, I never really plug it, but I am going to start now. I do have a Patreon. Um, obviously, YouTube is clamping down a lot on you know the people that you like to watch. Um, alternative media, as it were. Uh, and Patreon would really, really help out. So if you want to support the channel further, you enjoy the content, for as little as $2 a month, you can support the channel and have access to exclusive content. But that being said, guys, thank you all so much. I've been Mr. H. Take care.